Okay, well, we're gonna do some more Animal Crossing for a bit. I'm just gonna get my daily stuff out of the way. So we're kind of at the point where the Happy Home stuff is almost done. I still don't have my dumb flowers. So I might have to just maybe alternate this. I don't know. Like, I don't want this to be something where I'm just doing my daily stuff and then calling it quits because there's nothing to do. I didn't want to resort to the whole time travel thing to get the flower stuff, but I might have to. Either that or just, like, alternate it every second day or something. I don't know. But... It's, it's been almost four months now. Like, as crazy as that is to say, four months. Wait, why? I just got off the phone with Lottie. It sounds like that big music festival. Paradise planning. Went off without a hitch. So happy for everyone there. Of course, I was rooting for all of you all the way. And she also said that you, in particular, were invaluable in getting it off the ground. Well done. Anyhow, I have a bold idea I'd like to run past the established professional designer. Oh, maybe I'm not done. It's here to explain face to face. You think you could stop by resident services? Whenever you have time, that is. I know you're busy. Yeah, I mean... The thing is, it's not like I'm using it to gain an advantage. I know, like, I'm drawing an arbitrary line in the sand here. But... How many times am I gonna water plants and still get nothing? <laughs> it's just... I don't know. Alright, uh, I got my air conditioners for the house. I have, like, half a mil- Oh, well. Quarter of a million dollars worth of air conditioning units for the... For the venue. Very expensive. But I'm gonna place them indoors. Wait, pirate barrel? Where did this come from? Oh. I mean, I guess I can place that in the scene. Yeah, okay, I know where. And I did order mannequins, because maybe I'll do something outside the clo clothing store. Um, that's authentic from memory. Okay. I had my suspicions confirmed today as well. I woke up and I went out just to get some groceries and then on the way back, I'm walking back to my apartment and there's that smell again. The smell of what I was 90% sure was burnt beans. But, um, no, no, I wasn't sure. But a neighbor walked past. I was like, man, it smells like burnt beans in here. And the neighbor was like, wait, how do you know it's beans? And like, I know the smell of burnt beans. Did you burn some beans? And they were like, yes. <laughs> I was right. I know, th I know that smell. You're annoyed they took the option to put on custom clothes on the mannequins. Oh, was that a thing originally? That sucks. Imagine being called out by your neighbors like that. Well, the thing is, it's like... If you're used to beans... If you grew up with them as a big part of your diet, like a staple... You know what it smells like when someone burns them. That's the thing. It's such a specific smell and it's just a core memory. Just... Sometimes it happens. If you have to juggle a bunch of things or you forget, you can burn them and they have this smell. But, you know, I, I was right. They were beans.
I need to get exit signs. I don't think it's that embarrassing. It's like, it happens. People are human. Everyone has their own kitchen disasters. You burned rice this morning because you got distracted organizing your coffee mugs. Yeah, it's, it's very quick that it can happen. It only takes like a few seconds. So, it's understandable. Does that fit? Yeah, it fits. Alright. I need to get exit signs. Although, do I need one here? I don't think I need one here. This is my living quarters, so... Alright, cool. This is done. But, I, I felt so, so happy. Because I, I was... It was just one of those things that... Without question, I knew what it was. It is very important, especially if you're operating a venue in Australia, to have air conditioning. It is a must. Room's done. But I was thinking of more responses I could have given the AI stuff last night. It's just one of those things where when you have a conversation, then sometimes you might not have the best answer to something, and then afterwards you just think about it and you're like, man, I should have said that. <laughs> had plenty of that after I ended last night. I was like maybe up for another hour just thinking about stuff. I could have done better. Oregon homes don't need air conditioning because you're not used to needing them, but the last couple of summers have been dreadful and no one has any AC units. Yeah, that would suck. It's one of those things that you can definitely do without if the temperatures don't guarantee an extreme every year, but... Here, it's just one of those things where it's all but guaranteed. It's like, in the time span of ten years, maybe one of those- one or two of those years might be a summer that's not extreme. Granted, growing up, some of the, the houses we lived in, well, I say houses, they were like units, flats, whatever, like, very small accommodation. They did not have air conditioning. And so we used to have to use wet towels and um, portable air conditioning units that you would pour ice water into. They're not usually necessary, but climate change has fucked us. Yep. You got hit with an ice storm this week and the entire city is basically shut down. Holy crap. I'm glad we've started calling it climate change and stopped saying global warming because there were just so many people that just didn't understand the concept. What do you mean global warming? There's like ice storms. It's like, 
that's it's the, the same side. It's just two sides of the same coin. But I kind of gathered that because here our summer hasn't been very hot, which is concerning. If that happens, then it's like, well, it probably means something worse is going to happen in winter. Oh, I mean, this is fine at being here. Okay, pirate barrel. This can go here. Wait, where'd the pirate barrel go? Oh, damn it, because <laughs> I put it down. Uh, I put it down in the house and I put it away, that's why. Oh, I'm missing a slingshot. Our Australian winter's bad. Uh, when I say bad, I mean it's just more rainy than usual. Winter here is... I guess... It'd be more like, uh, spring to some places, where it's like a mix of sunshine and rain. Win our winter's not really winter. California winter's probably the best comparison, yeah. Well, this is good. A lot of stuff popped up. Okay. Okay, I can get on board with this. It's just, it gets really miserable. That's all. It's just constant rain. Not heavy rain, mind you. Just rain. It's just, you don't feel like doing much when it's like that outside. I gotta sell some of this stuff first. Oh, they got that now open sign again. Hold on. No, I don't need them. side of the venue, but I don't know. It's gigantic, and I don't like the design of it. This... I mean, I guess I'll get it. Oh. Wow, okay. I can still buy it. I just need the money. left over. I should probably get change while I'm here. Lunch apron? I mean, 
The only time I've seen these has been in a hos in a hospital. People wearing them. I could dress up like I'm s serving lunch. Maybe just that. I don't think I have this either. What is that? Oh. No. Just so, if I do take screenshots, it's visually different. Okay. At least when they burnt the beans, it wasn't as bad as last time. It was... The first time they did it, it was something catastrophic because the whole... just wing of the building that I'm in just stunk. This was just a, a pretty localized area, so I think the severity was not as bad. Okay, cool, another green one. They're getting better at beans. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I've I've had my share of kitchen disasters, but I feel like having food being burnt and what it was like what two weeks ago, maybe three. I've burnt food, but I can't say I've done it consecutively within the same month. Like, the worst I've... I think as far as burning goes, rice is probably the worst I've burnt. Oh, right, the bug off is today. It's already ended. That was at six, I forgot about it. Whoops. It's okay. I've already done it once. I could turn back the clock if I want to do it again. Gotta wonder what their pots look like now. It's a lot of burnt beans. Well, for it to stink up a whole section of the apartment, you'd be borderline ruining the pot. It would have been a pain in the ass to clean. The worst kitchen disaster I have had is I was trying to make a toaster, like using a sandwich press to make a sandwich. And it was not that late at night. It was, you know, pretty late, but not super late. But I accidentally, when I went to press it, I didn't realize just a small part of the cable got caught. And so. You know, I'm making myself a beverage in the background, and I just hear this this sound. I turn around, there's like this plume of fire. <laughs> it just erupts. It's okay, nothing caught on fire, and, you know, just I cut off power, but... The sandwich was fine, ultimately. It's just the sandwich press was not... These things, they happen. I think the scary thing is I didn't really react too strongly to the plume of fire because that wasn't the first time I had seen one. My cousin, when I was younger, I was over at his house and 
we were playing games. And there was a spider on the wall. And instead of just going to either, you know, take it outside or murder it, he says, watch this, he gets a can of his deodorant, gets a lighter and just turns it into a flamethrower to burn the spider. And his curtain catches on fire. It's like, I don't know, I guess because the, the plume of fire that I saw, because it was smaller than that, I guess I just didn't react harshly. I didn't panic, because his house was fine when it was that gigantic of a uh, eruption of fire that happened. So I figured out, oh, but I'm sure it'll be fine. I just love my aunt's... My aunt's logic. You disappeared for a second, what was the first fire? My cousin tried to kill a spider with deodorant and a lighter once, when I was a kid. And it was- it formed this gigantic, like, plume of fire. And his house was fine. Even when my aunt, like, saw it happen, and her reaction wasn't to try and deal with what was happening, more go to get the nearest object so she could, like, hit my cousin with it for being an idiot. She hit him with a broom. So because what happened with the sandwich press was just small, by comparison, I guess I just didn't react. I was like, oh, that's not that bad. <laughs> it's a small, small fire eruption. We'll be fine. It vanished pretty quickly, like it was just... I don't know if it makes sense. <laughs> like, I think an any appliance, I don't know, borderline exploding should have some form of reaction, but... I guess that one didn't. You're always worried about house fires because you know you'll panic and forget how to behave. Oh, here we get taught in schools, like, how to deal with fire because it's just... In some parts of the country, that's, like, a way of life. You have to always... ...be ready. So, it's just in case you ever end up living in one of those areas. It's the same with swimming. We all get taught swimming as well, like... How to deal with riptides and that sort of stuff. I'm just never gonna find this, am I? I mean, pretty much... There's... There's specific fires. Like, in the case of... Being fire... Just fire, and you don't know the cause of it... Then... The evacuation procedure is don't grab anything, just leave, pretty much. It's like, you might be tempted to recover a couple of things, but like, the mentality here is just, just leave. But if you're talking about like, fires and how they start, there's different things. Like a grease fire versus... A grease fire is like, scary. <laughs> Lurk, lurk, no worries. All good. I've seen a video of, like, what happens when you pour water on, on a grease fire. It's, it's scary. It's like an explosion happens. some of the stuff away. I don't think I need to customize anything. 
I mean, the mannequin stuff I'll deal with later. So where the others are. And then hopefully these will just grow and just fill in the rest of the area. Okay. Almost there. I just need to get those blue roses. There's just two flowers to go. Go to see Tom Nook later. Once all the daily stuff is done. I guess even though that painting was authentic, I already had it. Okay, uh, cool. So. This has to be moved. Wait, what color? They're two different colors. What color is this? Oh, this is purple. So then this one must be blue. Okay, yeah. Don't need blue. Getting there. Surprised that duplicator was just one there. Something's got to give. <laughs> this is a pretty big stack of them. I still haven't gotten purple.
Whoops. Oh, that means the concert's not on today either, because it's, yeah, the bugathon. I mean, I might turn back the clock and do it, just because it. Oh, but then the flowers would get unwatered. Eh, screw it. Because <laughs> you do get the Nook Mile stamp for competing in it, and it only happens once every three months, I guess. I don't know. Or once a season. I just completely forgot about it. This is all done, right? No? Okay. to customize before it breaks. I should probably go to Haas and do the thing before anything else. I just can't believe this combination is the one that's taken me the longest. I thought green mums were the ones that were going to take ages. Okay, we're done. shots. Look at halves first.
I'm curious to see like where this is gonna go after this is done now. Uh, um, it's fake, they're both fake. It's okay. The only reason I do this is just for the possession stuff, I guess. Obsession's health again. Okay. Oh, wait, I don't have anything to customize. Let me see. Just if there's anything that stands out. Have multiple bicycles. See, I want something to replace the statue in the park, but I have nothing. Oh yeah, this. I wanted this. Then we go get that out. Oh, it can't be customized, really? Alright, so I'm gonna place it with the, the stuff up the back. Like, I might make it a thing. Daily Island next. make this look very pirate themed up the back here and I could set up a stall 
but then it's like, oh, you're walking to some stall where it's like, it makes it look like it's an old pirate thing. I don't know what that stall would sell, but I'll figure it out. Alright, let's go. I could make it sell just treasure hunting supplies. I do have that map. There's probably other items that would make sense for it. been on a boat a few times and no I don't get seasick however I do know how it feels like to maybe not approach it but just the sensation that I guess amplifies for people that do get seasick Nothing but potatoes here. Doesn't look like it's anything else. I'll grab the stuff and just leave. Still hoping for that island that's set in spring, like with the cherry blossoms. Because then I can catch my dab. And make the fish and chips. Oh, well, that's disappointing. Alright. I mean, I may as well. There's also a thing to sell fruit, so I may as well. And to chop wood. Seth, how's it going, dude? How's things? I don't think I'm going to do the rock stuff. I mean, one of them could be a money rock, but... Eh. It's just going to eat up time. It's the weekend could be worse. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad it's the weekend. I've been, at, I've been back at work for two weeks, and it's already pretty hectic. Summer's been pretty mild. 
Not really any super hot days, it's just been manageable. Feels more like spring than summer. Is, is that one I've got in? I've just been checking out some newer games that have come out. I was playing this game yesterday that was, um... It's a game where you're a vampire and you have to try and trick people into letting you inside their house so you can eat them. But the catch to it is the whole thing runs off AI, so you... It does voice recognition and the responses are AI generated, so it's pretty interesting. Surprised at how well it recognized my voice, but the responses, they can be funny, because every character has, I guess, a personality you kind of have to play to, and it's just, ugh. It was very amusing how I got to get inside some of those homes. Yeah, other than that, not a whole lot. Just getting back into the swing of things with work. And playing Monster Hunter and Cyberpunk. Okay. I've heard Cyberpunk's in a much better state than what it used to be. You got yourself a Steam Deck. Oh, that's awesome. I wish they were sold here. Still no sign of them ever being sold here. The game is great since the 2.0 update. I might revisit it again one day. I really didn't get to play a lot of it because just the PS4 version was completely broken at launch. So I'd probably try it on PC and not PlayStation again just because first person shooting, well, just, you know, that kind of stuff. I'm better on keyboard and mouse. Plus the new PC. The new PC is great. Okay. Playing Cyberpunk on the PS5, it's been fantastic. Yeah, because they've done a PS5 patch since release, right? I think that was the difference. It's more just, I guess, my personal preference in terms of first-person shooters. I've just... Unless it has gyro aim, I kind of struggle a little. Using controller stuff, it's just because I'm not used to it. But I've heard so many good things about the Steam Deck. Particularly the OLED model is just supposedly amazing. It's weird because they're selling it in Southeast Asia, and usually when they do that, Australia is generally part of that rollout plan, but for some reason, it's just not there. So, I don't know. I mean, I'm okay. It's, you know, I got... It's one of those things that it would be nice to have, but it's not critical. I mean, I have the PC, and I still have the Switch. The Switch is fine. It does the job. And I'm streaming a lot of stuff anyway, so I'd be sitting at my PC most of the time. Like, even now with the Switch, it's just I'm at my PC. Aside from the, uh, the new computer, the other new toy I have is, like, this upscaler that upscales stuff to 4K. So, like, I'm running everything <laughs> through it. It's great. 
it has so many inputs, so any console I want, I can hook up into it. And Twitch has started their rollout of the new video codec that'll let you do 4K nicely, so... I applied for the beta, hopefully I get it. If I do, then yeah, stream will be in 4K. 2024K, it's happening. Wait, so who's crafting? I don't think Scoot is. Yeah, Scoot's not crafting. Who haven't I been to? Hmm. <laughs> the other game I have a morbid curiosity of that's just kind of exploded right now is um, Pal World. It's that Pokemon game. It looks like a Pokemon game, but it's with guns. That's like the simplest way to put it. But then... If you go beyond the surface level, it's more of a crafting survival game. But it, it just looks... It's one of those things that I'm sure they realize it's a meme game, and they kind of leaned into it in that regard when it comes to the Pokemon stuff. But apparently it's still good. It's like surprisingly good. You knew it was coming, Pal World. Yeah. I mean, Lelo has been playing it. He was going to like, to quote Lelo, poop socket today. <laughs> That's a term he used. So we'll see what his findings are. Because I can get a better idea of what the game's like after like six to eight hours of it. I, I trust his judgment on that stuff. There's no one. There's no one crafting. Who's. From what you've heard, it's meant to have pretty solid gameplay. Yeah. I think it's one of those things, though, that shines in a multiplayer sense. At least that's the impression I get from it. You're not home. Audie, are you crafting? Audie's not home either. Who's crafting? Am I going crazy? Is no one crafting? Yeah, you're not home, so then... Pietro. It has to be Pietro. It has to be Pietro. No, it's... What? No one's crafting. Alright, I guess leave it for now. Alright, well, now I can look into this. What is, what is going on here? We'll see how it goes, because it's still in early access, so I'm in no rush to do it. Plus, there's a bunch of other stuff I just oh, I want to check out. And right now, it's a good time period, because it's still a while before something major releases. Okay, the reason I called earlier is that I had an idea I wanted to run by you regarding everyone's homes. That's because I've been dropping hints here and there, but... Word of what you've been doing for Paradise Planning is spread and starting everyone talking. I received inquiries from folks who'd like you to remodel their homes. Quite a few, in fact. With that in mind, I'd like to begin offering a home design consulting... So oh! What this means 
for you is that whenever you have an idea for remodeling a resident's home, give those ideas to me here and Nook Inc. will work with the resident to make it a reality. Of course, there'll be a fee to get the ball rolling, but I'll give you some miles for each design finish. Around the island is eager to have you work on their homes, so there's no need to be shy. When I have an idea for someone's home, I'll be here to coordinate everything. Thumb up. Whenever you'd like to redecorate or remodel someone's house... Oh... Well... I guess it depends to what extent, and if I have access to all the Happy Home stuff. Because then, thematically, I can make... I can make it even more... More in line with what it is. Like, I could turn Scoot's home into an actual gym. Okay. I guess it depends how it works. Huh. Alright, alright, alright. Keep it in mind. Don't think that'll happen until the very end, though, but... If I'm able to do this to every villager's house, that's gonna be cool. I can make everything fit what I've done outside. Alright. It's neat. I'm gonna go now to the happy home thing and see what's going on over there. Since the music festival is done. There's a couple of other games that are on the horizon that want to check out eventually. There was a demo I checked out uh, the other day that was... It's like a 2D platformer and it's heavily inspired by Donkey Kong Country 2 and Yoshi's Island and... The demo was pretty good, but the game still ages away. And then there's another one that's like just so blatantly Simon's Quest, like even the name of it... I forget the name, but it's like a play on words. <laughs> and it just looks like an awesome take on... On Simon's quest, that's just obviously better and better thought out. Oh. Nah, and I'm a bit of a pickle. You see, I came here to give a brief lecture on bugs at the school. The trouble is, I can't seem to find it. I don't mean to be bothered, but would you be able to guide me to the school? This is new. I've never seen you before. Please settle down, everyone. It's time to begin my lecture on bugs. But I'd like to provide you a brief lesson on the scrumptious nature of my friends and yours, bugs. Actually, would someone be so kind as to tell me their favorite kind of bug? Let's see. Um, I guess butterflies are pretty neat. Nautilus, the way they float. To and fro, their colors matching the light. Butterflies are positively enchanting. This leads me to the subject of the ideal way to care for bugs. In short, I feel it best they not be kept in cages. That's right, I am of the opinion that bugs will always be at their happiest when allowed to roam free. On that note, I would like to request something of everyone who came to my class today. I'd like everyone to select a bug from their pockets and set it free into a vacation home's yard. Any bug at all. Because, oh, if you like your yards to be serene as this, or this, releasing bugs is... Ah. Okay. Do I remember to redeem my Nook points in the Nintendo app? What? Nook? You can redeem Nook Miles? In the Nintendo app? I don't really use the Nintendo app, to be honest. <laughs> I think the only time I've used it is pretty much just to import s stuff into this. What do you get from it? Hmm. 
and gives you items for the game. Oh. Huh. Then, no. Might have to look into that. It's okay. I've been doing fine so far. Was my free recipe. Oh. How am I today? I am doing okay. I'm just enjoying the weekend. I had to do boring adult stuff, but. Uh, been cool. How about yourself, Nova? Oh, they got that bike on sale again. Eh, yeah, nothing really what I want. Uh, that exchange rate's still fine. I guess I'm going for the throne, huh? I'm not sure what else to go for. Still tired, woke up not too long ago. Yeah, what's the time? Is it super early or is it just still tired? Oh, no suggestions here. Almost 10 in the morning. Oh, that's not too bad. Okay, I mean, I guess... Let's see what happens. Yeah, I work, pretty, I work up at around 10. I lost track of time last night. Bull Fieri. Movie stars, what do you want, Bull Fieri? A lighthouse? I got the feeling that's going to be one of those ones, it's just a single item. Yeah, I guess I do. I'm sure there's still plenty of recipes left. I'm just unlucky. What other themes have we got? I guess that's all for here. Chef. Fancy clothes. Animal. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I'm hoping that this will allow me to have the doghouse, because I, I really want the doghouse. Alright, we'll go with this one. This island. Okay. Hey, Sushi, how's it going? I've been trying to get the, the doghouse. So I can have it for the turtle. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Ah, uh, No, it might not have it. 
Cat, that's, that's, that's not really... Alright, um... This is the thing, I'm kind of running out of viable spots. I guess here. Yeah. Good, me? I'm doing alright. Just still enjoying the weekend. Boring adult stuff during the day, but otherwise fine. Single story. I was editing stuff from yesterday's stream with the AI thing. Just thinking of responses I could have said. Just, oh man, that was a missed opportunity. That game was fun. Okay. Gonna do the usual outside ten minutes. Wait, oh, Tiger Butterfly. All right. Guess that makes sense. Okay. So wait, how? Let me do the butterfly thing. Yeah. Okay, okay. You can use multiple plots? Oh. So you can pick the same plot and then, what, it gives someone else that same plot? I thought- oh well, it doesn't matter. That's eh, fine. It forces me to be creative and... Okay. Figure it out. Alright, so I'm gonna do 10 minutes outside, 20 minutes inside. Okay, 10 minutes outside, starting now. Okay, well. This is a strange theme because it's like. It talks about animals, but then it showed me a cash register. I don't know, we'll see. It's not a whole lot of room. Alright, well. Uh, let's go with... the other one there. And then, yeah. Hopefully I'm not spending too much time on this. Do I have spare gold roses? I haven't really grown many. I just grew what I needed to fill in the area that I have all my flowers in and then just left it at that and started focusing on the other colors I needed. Okay. 
I don't want to spend too much time on plowing. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's get furniture out now. What's on the order? How is Doghouse not part of this? Okay, let's just... I guess ignore this for now. Sometimes the themes are really deceiving. The exact pattern she has on her clothing. That one, traditional. Okay. Uh, where is? Go with that one. I'm just gonna make it like as if there is a doghouse involved and then hope for the best. This is kinda awkward. I guess put it there for now. It's being awkward. Can't place it. Damn it. Hang on. I'll go with that one. Okay, I got four minutes left. Uh, go. Trying to match. It's probably too bright. That's fine. Oops. I guess I need some of this stuff out here. This is what we want. Why? Why? Why over there? Why over there? Why? <laughs> Why over there? Mm. 
Why'd it do that? It's just random decorative elements. I hate how it doesn't smart rotate it. Like, I want it this way, but there's no scenario where I can rotate it this way currently. There we go. Man, that is a pain. Oh, that can't be customized. Okay, keep going, keep going. Sure. I got 30 seconds on my clock. <laughs> I'm following my clock. It says 30 seconds. I put a stopwatch. There's 10 seconds left. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to get much done. I don't know. Just quick random ones. <laughs> All right, now that's time. Oh, you were giving a reminder. I thought you were saying, like, that's time up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> when someone says time, it's like, oh, damn, I'm out of time. I get it. Um, I think I, as long as I can walk through it. So the only fine tune I'll do is, like, if something's in the way. Which I think I have to move that bed. Yeah, the bed's in the way. Just... I'll put it... I'm allowed to fine-tune it. Yeah, that's better. That's more functional. I mean, this is the thing. The theme is animals, but it's like, well... I guess I have to do better in indoors to convey that. Hmm. I mean, it's, it's a house. Alright, I have to do better in here. 20 minutes. Okay. Let me just set the room size. I have to lean into this a bit more. Twenty minutes in total. Oh. I mean, I think this is fine, the forest. All right. So, oh yeah, I need a cash register. What is this theme? They're running a store? All right, I'll work with it. Let's say they design stuff on Etsy. That makes no sense. It's like animal stuff a bird, but then there's there's clothing 
the thing makes no sense. But okay. Let's say this person runs a store and then has like a bedroom at the back. Okay. 20 minutes start now. I'll try my best. Um, always start with the floors. That'll do. I'm just going to set up the room first. So bear with. So you know, the... That's their bedroom up the back. Okay, so we've set that up. Okay. Now... Something that's like that'll do. Okay, that'll work. Now do this. It'll work. So this will hide the fact that there we go. Okay, cool. A little strange, but whatever. Hmm. I guess that's kind of overkill, huh? Okay, do this. The thing is, I did this yesterday, so it's like, well, this is almost a repeat. Okay. Um, I guess the other thing, all right, let's just make sure I do enough of this. It has to really lean into the toy aspect. has to really l lean into it because I did not do that outside I won't use all of them I guess the pandas aren't customizable I got this. Oh, what? That's not allowed? And these counters are so deceiving. Don't use windows. Okay, we need replacement counters. Um... Give me a minute. Sure. 
surely that works. That doesn't work, why? What about this? Okay, apparently not allowed. Alright. I have to go plan B. It's fine. I can still do the theme. Oh, it's this. It's this one. This one can be placed on. Okay, cool. Whoops. Not that. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Duplicate the bears. Right, and then... Trying to come up with like better contrast. All right, that's cool. Okay, this is easy enough. This is probably overkill. But what I can do is place this here. Okay. I'm trying to mix it up between clothing and, like, just stuff that gets made. I hate to have the same thing multiple times, but it's gonna have to do. out clothing just stuff that matches the theme of animals dirty uh, da, 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 da. hold on okay so f so far I've, uh, I've got 12 minutes left so it's going fine uh, I've already got that yep that'll do Okay, that's that. Okay, now... Need to come up with a bedroom in the back, so we'll do that. is very much on the fly. Um, buh, 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 buh. Where's the music? I need... Where's that lily player? Oh, this will be fine to add as a decoration. Is it part of this, maybe? Is it in history? No, okay, hold on. Uh, after this, I'm gonna play some Odyssey. I just want to, like, make sure I dedicate the time for what I want to do tonight. Because I'm playing three different games. Oh, where is this thing? I know it's here. Boxes. I've probably gone past it in a panic. 
There it is. Just to mix it up. Suck up last. Nah, I'm done with suck up. Like, I finished it yesterday. It's cool, I might revisit it in the future once it's gotten more updates, but for now, that's that's done. What happened? What do you mean? I just finished it. <laughs> but it just says, congratulations, you finished the game. That's all it says. It's in early access, so, you know, it's, it's understandable, but it's not fully fleshed out. What about the mansion? Oh, the rich tech dude. I got him. I convinced him. Because, uh, I made it... I just asked him what he wanted to talk about, and then he fell for it. <laughs> That's all I needed to do. Wanna, I just asked him, want to be on the po my podcast? He said yes, and then I was like, cool, what do you want to talk about? I made him sound like an expert. And then it worked. Too drastic a change. It's amazing, just what happens when you let people do the talking themselves. Considering the trouble I had, just in kind of incredible, just how easy it ended up being. I mean, this is all homemade stuff that could be on sale, so you know, just... Someone who does a lot of home decoration sells. That's cool. Alright, that's fine. No paintings. Yeah, the stuff as well. Let's just do that. I'm just thinking of someone that runs like an art, arts and craft store out of their home. I guess that's what I'm gonna roll with. And they do things with animals and plants just as their theme, I guess, nature. I don't know, this theme was strange. It's not what I expected it to be. Okay, well, I got time for good lights, so let's do good lights. Let's do my old fancy lighting trick. should cover all the rooms. Alright. I think it needs to be lower. It's okay, I'll fix it. This time. Incorrect. Have to make sure it aligns. Okay. Oh, I accidentally. What did I do? That. There's extras.
that's a line. Now move them together. All right. There's still plenty of room, so let's just work with it a bit more. I've got like four minutes. I think we can make use of this space a bit better. There we go, that's better. I might... Let's go... Hats. Where are the hats? <laughs> Where are the hats? There they are. Okay, um... Yep, bunny is. Just stuff that matches, I guess, the animal thing. Cat is. Uh, not the skull. It's probably not a good one. Yeah, flower crown. And that. Just things that would be like, oh. I made these. Actually, hold on. Better idea. These will go here. This here, so I got room for more. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Yep, hair clip. Uh, that. And we'll go with that. Hang on, already got. That's probably too close to the light. That's fine. Yeah, that'll do. This feels random. I might get rid of it. I mean, I'm kind of surprised I'm kind of done for the most part. I guess, yep, if the pet wants to sleep in here, it'll sleep in that corner there. Where's the pile of... There's usually like a pile of clothing. Is it not here? Apparently it's not here. Alright, hang on. It should be here somewhere. I got like a minute to look for it. It's probably after this set of drinks and stuff. Um, hurry up, hurry up. That might be nice to just place down. That's what I was looking for, thank you. Just to make the counter look a bit more busy. That can be here. Okay, um... Still got time. I need... This. And this. That, I think, is fine. Almost out of time. Oh boy, this is gonna be tricky. 
Nah, I'm gonna run out of time to get rid of it. Otherwise, it's gonna look bad. Half done. Two seconds. Alright, done. <laughs> I wanted to put them around the whole room, but it's, it's honestly fine. Yeah, I mean... This theme confused me more than anything. Wasn't what I was expecting. Just the framing of it was like, oh, a home with animals, but then the stuff I got for it was like to run a clothing store, so I don't know. I did what I could, it's within the theme of it. At least I leaned into it more than I did outside. Outside is just like, well, it's a house. This at least, it's well, someone is running a business and they live here as well, so. I think it's fine. It'll do. Oh, the air conditioning is like causing the clothing to react. It's not, it's not my greatest work. <laughs> Cause just the theme was so uncertain, but it's fine. It works. They're into arts and crafts and they sell their arts and crafts out of a store that they run in their house. It, it's like the one that, um, I forgot what the theme was, but... The name kind of implied that it was going to be a theme around space and I thought, oh, that's going to be cool. It's going to have those... Those furniture pieces that have got to do with, like, the moon and the stars, it didn't. <laughs> I think the only thing I got that was relevant was the telescope, and that was it. That was the only thing that was part of the theme. It was so disappointing. Or oh, that was that other- oh, the one that I did recently that it just, for some reason, tacked on a gym. It was completely unrelated. Anyway. I gotta head back. That's fine. I'll work my way towards that throne. You know, some folks at your level would rest on their laurels. Not you, though. It's quite impressive. You put in so much hard work, if I were to put it another way, I'd call you a superstar designer. Now then, to acknowledge all your efforts, your payment's a little higher. Okay, cool. I have truly arrived. By the way, our selection of work clothes has been updated. Now nah, I'm fine. This always suits my mood. I bet you're ready for that job now. That job? Oh, sorry. If that sounded ominous. It should be fun. I think we should add a gallery to the cafe. Oh. Of course, we'll need to put it on another floor. But there'll be a lot of design work and decisions. I think it'll make our clients really happy. A gallery? What do they mean by gallery? I don't think I've ever... I guess in the context of a cafe, it's just an eating area? Question mark? I don't know. Um, I'll, mm, I might buy this just to put it as a prize in the arcade. What is that al- what is that album art? <laughs> what? I think I have that already. Okay, look. Eh, Leopold's here again. Alright. I'm going home. Yeah, I don't 
don't need that. Okay. I just want to double check that I have that album. I haven't planted the money tree yet either. I need to do that too. Okay. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Oh, wait, I need to save the album first. I think I've got too many items on my island. Like, I can see it load in. It's almost lagging. Doesn't look like I have that one. That might be why, just visually it's similar to that one. Okay. Well, maybe not, I don't know. <laughs> I thought it was. Okay. And for the other stuff, I'll just get more simple panels because I have other plans. Can never have too many. Was here. Had nowhere to fall into, and it just sank into the ground. Uh, I mean, I'll try the other rocks first. I should have known better. I just thought it was going to bounce to the right. Isn't it? I can move stuff. It's not like this is something that I care too much about. Okay. 
Wait, it's not this one? What, which one is it then? I mean, it's cool because I kind of want them to be here in the mountains anyway. Because then it makes sense. I can, I'm going to redo this path eventually. Is it this one? I guess it's this one. Yeah, there we go. just make these mountain potatoes, you know? <laughs> I don't know. Eventually I'll figure it out. It's just for now, but just live here. Okay. Last thing, um, aside from planting the money tree, is just finding daily furniture. Well, that's good. That I can decorate the houses here. It just means there's one more thing to do. This is in a bad spot, I think. Hang on, I need to move this. I'm sorry, Pietro. <laughs> Gotta move them. Whoops. Sorry, excuse me. You can smell them now. There's one. I might just make this permanent, honestly. Because then it's easier to access that tree. I need a shovel. Mm -hmm. 
Wait, where is it then? Oh, wait. There's still two trees left. There might be Scooch tree. Maybe I should replace that with a fruit tree so then I don't have to shake it. Uh oh. Oh crap, I swung too early. Yeah, that was awkward. Okay, uh, it's gotta be Scoot's tree then. I feel like I've shaken... Oh no, there's still Audie's house. I'm gonna do that quickly. another protein shaker bottle. Well, I know exactly who would want one of those. everything. Oh, and this. I don't want that. Laziness. I could probably craft it, but Sasha, come on. You can do it. Ah. I mean, I waited. I was polite. dancing fruit. The only thing I didn't find was who was making something today. No one was crafting. Oh wait, Pekka's home. Maybe Pekka. That's the only thing. Unless I, I my memory is just horrible. No, you're not making anything either. It might be because the bug off is on. I think this happened with the fishing thing as well, like no one was crafting during that event. Ooh, 
Well, the only other person I haven't visited is Audi. Sasha's out and about. Ah, it's fine. It's no biggie. Alright, well that'll do it for Animal Crossing for today. It's good to know that I can still decorate the villagers' houses so there's stuff to do. But I, I really need these flowers to just appear. <laughs> Alright, well if you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end of the video and hope you've been enjoying the playthrough of this so far. If you do want to support the channel over there, the easiest way to do so is just click the like button, or you can also watch me do other things by clicking one of the videos that pop up. It does help out the channel a lot, so thank you to those that do do that. But we'll do more of this soon. Till next time, bye YouTube.